This is the solution to written homework 44. Okay, so the answer to part A, the total money flow is integral 0 to big T f of little t dt and the only thing that we're given is f of little t so that's integral 0 to big T of 1000 dt well that's simple enough the answer is 1000 times big T so that's saying that so ie If t is, say, seven years, then the total money flow is $7,000. Okay. Part B is saying that, well, let's compute the limit as big T goes to infinity of that expression, 1000 T. Well, that's obviously infinite. So therefore, uh, the total money flow is unbounded. That is in the end because what you're doing is you're you're integrating this constant 1000 uh, per year and you're saying from t is 0 from little t is 0 to little t is big T, and what you're asking for is this area. So this area, obviously, is 1,000 t, 1,000 big T. And as you let big T go to infinity, that's an infinite amount of area. So this has an infinite amount of area. As big T, the location of that right fence post goes to infinity. Okay, so now let's find the present value of the money flow up to year big T. So C, that saying, Let's compute the integral from 0 to big T of exponential negative r little t f of t dt. Okay. So that is equal to exponential, uh, sorry, integral 0 to big T exponential of negative 0 0.10 little t and then 1000 d little t. Okay, well that 1000 is just a constant so it can be factored out. So that's a 1000 and then we can use the fundamental theorem for this. So that's exponential negative uh, 0 0.10 and then divided by negative 0 0.10 and then from 0 to big T. So dividing by uh, 0 0.10 gives you 1,000 by that gives you 10,000. So that's 10,000. And then I'll spend this negative to reverse the order of evaluation and get 1 over exponential 0 
10, little t, and then from big T to 0. So that's 10,000. And then when you plug in 0 into there, that's exponential of 0, which is 1. So that'd be 1 minus uh, 1 over exponential of 0 0.10 big T. Okay, so that's the present value of the money flow. Okay, and that's if, that's supposing that you stop the procedure at capital T years. So now for part D, now we're going to uh, let T go to infinity in this expression. The limit as big T goes to infinity of that thing. So 10,000 uh, times 1 minus 1 over 0 uh, exponential. Zero point ten uh, big T. Well, ten thousand is a constant. One is a constant. Uh, exponential of zero point ten T goes to infinity, so one over that goes to zero. So the answer is ten thousand times one minus zero, which is to say ten thousand. Okay. That is $10,000 <laughs> for all time. So the ungraded part is to try and consider why are these, uh, why are these equivalent? How could it be that this has an infinite amount of money, but the present value of this infinite amount of money is just ten thousand dollars. This is saying this says that given a ten percent interest rate receiving receiving ten thousand right now is the same or is like receiving One thousand every year forever. <clears throat> Interesting. 